I knew it. The Marquette basketball camps have long been a staple of the program, and that tradition is important to head coach Buzz Williams and his staff. I probably make them more important than, than they should be. It's vitally important to me. Uh, I'm here from start to finish every single day. I know that parents work really hard, and it's very important to them uh, that they send their children to a camp. They want them to be taught something worthy of being taught, and they want them to be treated the way they would have been treated at home. I think Coach Williams' idea of what a camp should be is, is, is twofold, and I agree with him. It, it's, it's for the kids to have fun, but it's also to teach them something. We don't want to just run around and play games and have kids just have a feel-good party all the time. We really want to actually teach the kids something, not just about basketball, but about life as well. We try to really concentrate on specific basketball skills as well as how that relates to specific life skills. And I know these are young kids, but I think it's really important. I know Coach Williams thinks it's really important to start as early as you can in developing a mindset for what it's about to be not only a good basketball player, but a man and, and a mature person who makes great decisions in their life. And we try really hard to do that in all phases. And we also have a lot of fun, so it's, it's a combination of all those things. Running the camps is coordinator of student athlete development, Brad Autry. The MU Summer Camps director is full of energy. You have got consolation You're around to learn. You understand that you and has a strong commitment to making this camp a success for the program, but even more importantly, the kids. I think what we want as a program to get out of it is for the community, through the kids, to get a window into who we are as a program, who we are as people, who we are as coaches. Coach Williams is very involved in the camp, as well as all the coaches on staff. And it's basically a window for the entire the city of Milwaukee and Wisconsin and the community of Marquette to see who we are as people, as well as to bring them into the Marquette family a little bit. Now, in terms of what we want to bring to the kids, first of all, an appreciation for work. We want kids to come here excited. We want them to have energy. And we want to have enthusiasm for what they're doing every day. That's always easy the first day. It's not always easy on Wednesday or Thursday, but we try every morning when we open those doors for these kids to have energy about becoming better as both a person and a player. There's not enough time in the course of the week for us to teach a young man to be a great basketball player. But we can give him the tools within a, a particular skill set to help him down the line to understand if I continue on with this process, I have a chance. And we feel the same way about their life. If I continue on with this same process of bringing energy, intensity, and enthusiasm to camp daily in whatever endeavor they're going into, they've got a chance in life to become successful in whatever they do. Autry says that camp counselors from across the country want to be part of the MU camp staff. After those are picked, they are mixed in with current and former Marquette players to give the kids instruction, guidance, and life lessons. Um, it's fun because, you know, everybody was a kid at one point, and, you know, we all had dreams of playing college ball and wanting to be around a college and professional players. So when they see how we made it, you know, they're like, okay, I want to be like them, and they want to do it. So us being around them and helping them with the little things, you know, it's, it's, it makes everything better. I just enjoy, like, watching the kids really work hard and go after it, get after it. Like, when you're trying to tell them to get after it and attack their player, they, they listen to you and they respond. When I was younger, I kind of understand how they feel and, and their excitement that they have when they first get here in the mornings and, and when they leave, when they get tired and everything. So, I mean, working with them is just great. You know, they, they, they really look up to us, and you can tell when you look in their eyes that, you know, they love being here and they love being around us. I mean, I just love it just because I remember being at that age, and I feel like, you know, I've been given the opportunity to have an impact on young basketball players. Being able, I remember thinking when I was that age how what it was like to see an NBA player, and now I know it's obviously just the normal people, but it's just cool to go back and to, and to know that they're willing to listen probably more to maybe me about basketball than maybe a coach who they don't think is very good at basketball or a parent that they hear every day. So I enjoy just coaching them. In his short time at MU, head coach Buzz Williams has preached family to his players and embraced the history of the school. And the camps are one way of melding the past and present together. Yeah, Coach Williams has been great. I mean, I know when, when Coach Green was here, he always had former players come around. And we never really, I don't, I don't think you fully understand how important that is until you're a former player. And now you really realize how, how nice it is that Buzz has been so welcoming and having guys like me back and obviously Wes and Jarrell and those guys are fresh faces to leave. But they're still coming back and I think that that's important for recruiting and just as a, a Marquette family it's nice to know that you're always going to be able to get in touch with guys because they're always coming back and the coaching staff has been great with inviting us back and, and you know letting us always use the facilities and play with the guys and 
and it means a lot. Yeah, you know, it gives me a chance uh, to meet Buzz and his coaching staff and see how Buzz does things and uh, kind of see the new players and uh, interact with the players a little bit. It's great. Once you go to Marquette and you graduate, Marquette is in you. Marquette is who you are. And they all come back and, you know, they'll play open gym with us. They all come back and they help with the camp because, you know, even though they're old, they're still Marquette and they just, they're Marquette like everybody else and they're going to help all these little kids just learn and hopefully, you know, make their dream come true. Each player, coach, and counselor is continually touched by certain events and plays throughout each camp and can recount these stories with ease. We had a team down 12 with about a minute and a half to go, hit four straight three-pointers, send the game into overtime. So uh, that would be a big memory for me. They were a lot bigger than the other team that they were playing, and, and they were beating them. And, and I think the point guard, he was, he was a lot taller, a lot stronger. And when it got to a certain point, I, I realized that he gave everybody else a chance. And at this age, a lot of kids don't understand that. You know, they feel like they should just score, 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 you know, impress the coaches, impress everybody. But he really understood that, you know, he wanted to get everybody else as a team involved, you know. And I really like that for his age, that maturity level. He did a crossover in the lane, spun, and I'm talking the highest floater that I have ever seen. And I was looking, and it was me and uh, Trent, and we were standing over here, and we were, and we were looking, and the ball went so high up, and I was like, no way. And it dropped, and I, he backpedaled and pointed right at me, and I was like, okay. And, I mean, that's, that's what all the kids do. They're here to try to impress us, you know, so we can be like, good job. Whether it's meeting an NBA player. Where are you from? Kohler. Kohler, all right. Playing in the games. <laughs> winning a contest. or even hitting a buzzer beater. It all comes down to helping the kids. Some of those guys are going to grow up and play for Marquette someday, and they'll remember their years of coming to our camps, and that's important to me. It's really important for us to be good basketball coaches, but more important is the passion that you bring every day about helping kids. I had people in my life that helped me as a young, young man figure out how to be a better man and how to be a mature man. People that come into your life leave a positive influence on those children and hope that you leave a mark that they can use the rest of their life. And I think that's what sets our camp apart, the passion with which we try to teach that to these kids.